Hello everyone, welcome, and welcome back to Teacher Grace Science course. Today, we will be talking about homogeneous and heterogeneous mixture. You have learned that, all living things are made up of matter. Matter is anything that occupies space, and has mass. Such as, table, tin cans, books, kitchen wares and even us humans. Almost everything around us, that we see are all made up of matter. Except light. Light is a form of energy, and neither have mass, nor occupies space. There are four phases of matter, such as solids, liquids, gases and plasma. And that would be for another lesson. Matter can be broken down into two categories such as pure substance and mixture. There are two types of pure substance, such as elements and compounds. On the other hand, mixture has two types as well, such as homogeneous and heterogeneous mixture. And today, we will be talking about homogeneous and heterogeneous mixture. So, what is the difference between homogeneous and heterogeneous mixture? Homogeneous is a type of mixture that has uniform mixture or same composition. Identifying mixture is pretty easy. By just looking at the mixture, you can easily identify whether it is homo or hetero. Homo means one, therefore, one of the indication that a mixture is a homogeneous is if it has one phase or one color throughout its composition. For example, this apple juice. You can clearly see one phase or one color throughout its composition. On the other hand, heterogeneous mixture is a type of mixture in which the composition is not uniform throughout its composition. Hetero means different. Therefore, in the mixture, you can see different compositions and you see different colors as well. Let us take for example this fruit salad. In fruit salad mixture, you can clearly see and identify the different ingredients, and is quite colorful than the apple juice. Now, in 5 seconds, I would like you to identify whether the following is homogeneous, or heterogeneous mixture. And count how many correct answers you got. Let's start. Now, count your score and see the equivalent percentage below. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more grade 5 to 10 science lessons. See you next time.